Welcome to the second lesson of the Stripe Marketplace Express Plugin course. This video will guide you on how to purchase and install the plugin. It will also help you on how to integrate Stripe with your Bubble app using API keys. So let's get started. So the Stripe Marketplace Express plugin can be found in different ways. We will first see how to find it on Bubble and then we will see how to find it on the Zero Code website. So on the plugins page of the Bubble website, on the community created plugins, you can search for the plugin by typing in Stripe or Stripe Marketplace. Then select the plugin that says Stripe Marketplace Express. Afterwards, you'll be redirected to this page where you can find more information about the plugin. You can also find different links to the demo and documentation pages. There's also a link to the Zero Code forum if you need any help or have any questions about the plugin. And on this drop down right here, you can select the app in which you'd like to install the plugin through the Bubble Editor. But before we demonstrate how to do that, let's see how we can find the plugin on the Zero Code website. So to get to the Zero Code website, simply head over to zerocode.com. Then to get to the plugins page, you can hover your mouse on the Build menu tab. Then select the menu link that says Plugins. So on this page, you can type in the word Stripe or Stripe Marketplace within the search box. Then after clicking on the correct plugin, you'll be redirected to the Zero Codes plugin page. Here, you can read more about the plugin and you can also read on some frequently asked questions. You also have the option to see the live demo or the demo editor of the Stripe Marketplace Express plugin. And upon clicking the button that says Buy Plugin, you will see a pop-up that shows a couple of steps which outline how to purchase the plugin through the Bubble Editor. It's important to note that you can purchase plugins only through the Bubble Editor. And the steps that you see here are the steps that we'll be demonstrating now. So to purchase and install the plugin, head over to your Bubble app. Then click on the Plugins tab. Afterwards, click on the button that says Add Plugins. And on this pop-up, you can type in Stripe or Stripe Marketplace. Then on the result that says Stripe Marketplace Express, you can click on the Buy button to purchase and install the plugin. But we already have it purchased and installed on our app. So to locate the plugin after you have purchased it, simply click on the Plugins tab and then locate the plugin within the list of installed plugins. And then click on the correct plugin. Here, you can see some information about the plugin. And when you scroll down, you will see a couple of fields where you can add your API keys from Stripe. And in a few moments, I'll demonstrate how to set up your Stripe account to obtain your API keys in order to insert them within these fields. In addition, we are also given the plugin content box, which you can have a look at in order to get familiar with the different types of elements, data calls, events, and actions which you can use with this plugin. And you also have the option to uninstall the plugin if you wish to remove it from your app. Lastly, there's a section where you can leave a review about this plugin. Kindly leave genuine feedback so we can improve our product if there is any issue. But as promised, we'll now show you how to set up your Stripe account and obtain your API keys so that you can insert them within your plugin settings. So to get started with setting up your Stripe account, simply head over to stripe.com. And if you don't have a Stripe account already, then go ahead and register your account and verify your email address. Then after you have registered for an account, you want to activate your account by clicking the button up top that says Activate Account. Then you'll need to complete the required fields in order to get your account activated. Afterwards, you'll need to obtain your API keys for the plugin. In order to do that, you can click on the button that says Developers and then click API Keys. Here, you will see the publishable key as well as the secret key. Now simply copy these keys and then we'll need to paste them within the settings of the plugin. Now, within the settings of the Stripe Marketplace Express plugin, you'll need to paste the secret key within the API key field for both the development version as well as the live version. And again, you'll need to do the same thing for the Stripe publishable key for both the live version as well as the development version. But kindly note that when adding the secret key, you'll need to add the word Bira before the API key for both the live version as well as the development version in order for the API key to work as expected. 
And that's how you can integrate your Stripe account with your Bubble app using API keys. So this brings us to the end of lesson two. And in the next lesson, we'll talk about Stripe Connect, which is the fastest and easiest way to integrate payments into your software platform or marketplace. So if you're planning on developing a platform or marketplace app, then lesson three is especially for you. Thanks again for watching and I'll see you on the next one.